What's up friends? Welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing well. I wasn't planning on filming another video today, but I just got this in the mail. These are the items that I ordered from the new Guerlain collection. It is inspired by butterflies, so I thought I would pop on here, show you guys what I got, do a bit of a demo, and give you guys all my thoughts. If you guys are interested in hearing a little bit more about this collection and seeing what I got, then keep watching. And if you are new here, welcome, welcome. My name is Sophia, and this is my channel, Sophia Sees Beauty, where we talk about all things beauty and luxury. I upload content every single week on and all the newest luxury beauty releases. Some of my favorite brands are Guerlain, Tom Ford, Chanel, Dior, Suku, you name it. So if that sounds interesting to you, then hit that subscribe button and click the notification bell to hear about every time I upload a new video. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, guys. It definitely helps me out. And as always, I will link everything that I mentioned in this video in the description box down below so that you can shop this collection. Okay, so let's talk about the products that Guerlain has recently launched this summer. It's a little bit confusing because they're kind of marketing all of these new products to together, but they launched the products at different times. So first they launched their new eyeshadow quads. Guerlain has not launched eyeshadow for quite some time to my knowledge. These are called the Ombre G eyeshadow quads. They launched six different colorways and these are six different colorways that are inspired by nature. That's what it says on their website. They're inspired by nature. If you guys didn't catch it already, I have already done a review of these eyeshadows for you guys. I specifically was reviewing this one, which is called Majestic Rose. So I will link that video down below. And then it also seems like the other popular one is this one that I have right here, which is called Mystic Peacock. If you guys are interested in a review of this one, just let me know. I am planning on probably filming one soon, but this came just before I left for vacation. So I haven't filmed that review quite yet, but I just want to quickly show these to you guys. Bottom line is I've really enjoyed these so far. They also launched a new mascara. This is called the 24 hour intense curl and volume mascara. I did not pick that one up so unfortunately I don't have any thoughts on that so yeah first they launched the eyeshadows and the mascara and then what you guys are probably here for is they launched these beautiful new butterfly inspired lipstick cases and new metallic lipstick so let me show you guys what I got from this collection that's what I'm going to focus on in this video once again it came impeccably packaged in this beautiful box and then all of their lipstick cases if you guys haven't ordered these before I'll kind of show you what they look like and what the deal is but they come in these beautiful velvet cases and I will show you guys which one I got eee! so beautiful. So I got the nude one. I will post some close-ups for you guys so you can sort of appreciate what this looks like. So the way that these lipsticks from Guerlain work is that first off, you have a case. You buy the case separately. This retails for $38. So it basically just comes like this in its own little box. And then you can kind of mix and match the cases with the lipsticks. And these lipsticks retail for $34. So altogether, you're paying about like 70 ish dollars for the whole package, but once again, you can kind of take any of your other Guerlain lipsticks, you can match it with the case and vice versa. And these, like, if you haven't purchased one of these before, watch out because you will get addicted by these. They're so weighty and luxurious. You guys will know, you know, like I've kind of come for brands in the past, <clears throat> Chanel, where like the products are very, very expensive, but the packaging is a little bit plasticky. It's a little bit lacking. That is not the case here. This is like, it's a paperweight. It's so luxurious. It's so beautiful. I love how shiny it is. In fact, when you pop it up, the case actually opens up like this. And what you have here is a little mirror. So you basically can use the little mirror to apply your lipstick like that. Very luxurious. It's a cute little experience. That's kind of how it works. And then you just sort of press the mirror down. You go like this and you'll see this little bit right here. That's what kind of keeps the mirror Close. So I want to first comment on the cases and then we'll talk about the lipsticks and we'll do an application. So the cases come in three different colorways. We have a beautiful bright scarlet red. I'll put some images up here so you guys can see. We have a gorgeous bright blue and then we have the one that I got which is kind of like, I don't know, I guess you would call this like the neutral one out of the three. I don't know why I went for this one. I just I found it very aesthetically pleasing. I also like the way that these colors kind of matched up with the color of lipstick that I chose. So we'll talk about that one in a second. And I don't really know how to describe the texture of this. It's very smooth. It almost feels like, like a synthetic leather. Like it feels a little bit leathery. It's very smooth. It's very beautiful. You guys will see here, it kind of matches the metallic look of the lipstick. So it has a nice, beautiful sheen, but it's not glittery. 
week. The only thing that I do want to mention is that I just noticed, I don't know if you can see that, like when I sort of dig in with my nail, you see how it kind of leaves a dent? I don't know if that'll sort of smooth out over time, but if you're somebody who is just a little bit like that bothers you maybe these might not be the best cases but i just wanted to sort of demonstrate what the texture feels like for these cases so there you have it there's three different colors this is the one that i got and honestly it's more beautiful in person. I'm really, really happy with it. Once again, also these retail for $38. All right, now let's talk about the lipsticks. I'll tell you guys what shade I got. These are called the 16 Hour Wear Velvet Metal Lipsticks. These, according to the creative director, are inspired by butterfly wings. And so when you think about a butterfly wing, it's not glittery, it's not sparkly, but they do have kind of like that beautiful sort of metallic sheen. You know, when like the sun sort of like hits a butterfly wing. Have you ever seen like a butterfly flapping around in a garden? I think you guys know what I'm talking about. So basically both the cases and the lipsticks, they're trying to kind of invoke that beautiful sheen. So what are we gonna get from these? They're not gonna be super glittery. They're not gonna be too, too flashy. This is Guerlain. I don't think that they would release something like that. I don't think that us as Guerlain customers, I don't think that's really what we're into, like super glittery lipsticks. What we're getting from this is like a really nice, beautiful, soft metallic sheen in six wearable colors. So the color that I got is number 888, which is called Noble Burgundy. And I'll show you guys right here what this swatch looks like. I also took some close-ups. I am filming in natural light right now, so I've got some daylight from my window. So you guys can kind of see what that looks like. It, it has a sheen to it but it's not crazy metallic. Like it's not a tacky metallic. And more or less, this is supposed to be the same formula as their other Rouge G Velvet lipsticks. It just has a little bit more of like that metallic texture. So let's give this a try. This is gonna be a first impression for me. I've only swatched this. I do have a lot of the other Guerlain lipsticks in my collection, but I have not tried this on yet. So I'm really excited to try this on with you guys. Let's apply. All right. Hmm. And this is Guerlain, which is first and foremost a fragrance company. So these are fragrance. They have kind of like that powdery sort of violet and rose kind of scent. I quite like it. This is very pigmented. Like you guys can tell it's going on very smoothly. It's very creamy, but it packs a punch. It packs a punch. Okay, so I just cleaned that up a little bit. I'm used to using a lip liner. So I cleaned it up a little bit. So what do you guys think this is noble burgundy i definitely think it pulls a little bit more red i guess this is burgundy but i'll just kind of show you see how there's a slight sheen but i don't think i would look at somebody wearing this and say she's wearing metallic lipstick like i think it's very subtle and elegant i like this i think especially you know someone like myself i already have a lot of girly lipstick cases and lipstick so i like that they're doing something different here it's a little bit more edgy it's fun it's playful girly already have so many wearable shades they have tons of reds they have nudes they've got pinks they've got they have a lot of different formulas and everything like that. So I think it's great that they're bringing something else to the table. I do not see on their website that these are limited edition. So maybe these are now a part of the permanent collection. Limited edition means different things from different brands. I've noticed that a lot of the cases that they launched months ago are still available for purchase. So I don't know. I don't know if these are going to sell out really fast. I still see that all of them are still available on the Guerlain website. I definitely don't think that this lipstick is going to wear for 16 hours. That hasn't been my experience with the other lipsticks from Guerlain. I don't have any lipstick that wears for 16 hours, but it is very comfortable. It's a beautiful matte. It's very hydrating. These are long wearing. So when it comes to lipsticks, Guerlain is definitely at the top. They don't need to last for 16 hours. I think my general thoughts on this collection are that I really like it. Personally, I think that these cases are beautiful. I think it's really fun. Like who doesn't like butterflies? It's very feminine. I like the different colors. I like that they're doing something a little bit different with the metallic lipsticks, but I still think that everything here, it's still very sophisticated. It's very French. It's very Guerlain. I think if you already have a lot of other Guerlain lipsticks, this would be a really great formula to try. If you don't have any Guerlain lipsticks or lipstick cases and you haven't experienced their formula yet, then maybe pick up one of the cases, but you don't have to get the metallic lipsticks. You can pair these cases with any of the other lipsticks in their collection. So if you feel like you're just 
not quite ready to go for like a metallic velvet just yet, you can get something from their classic collection. You can get a classic red, a nude, a rose, anything like that. So I do want to mention that you don't have to pair these together. You can mix and match, which I think is great. Anyway, guys, that's my thoughts on this collection. Same amazing quality from Guerlain, same great cases and lipstick formula, just with a little bit of a twist and a little bit of sort of natural inspiration. If you guys like this video, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Also, I would love to hear from you guys in the comments. Sound off down below and let me know what you think of this collection. Did you pick anything up? Which of the cases did you get? Which of the colors did you get? And finally, I would also really love to know what do you think of metallic lipstick? Do you think that Guerlain did a really great job with this? What do you think of this shade? I would love to hear from you guys. So sound off in the comments down below. And if you haven't subscribed already, what are you waiting for? Because we have so much fun over on this channel. I upload content every single week on all the newest luxury beauty releases. And we would love to have you be a part of the fam. So hit that subscribe button. And also follow me on Instagram for all of the latest on beauty launches, when things go on sale, when things come back in stock. That's where I let you guys know first when these types of collections launch. So head on over to Instagram and connect with me over there. I hope that you guys are having a fantastic day and I will see you in my next one. Goodbye.